and welcome back guys we're going to be playing some more fallout 76 let's see where this lovely train ride ends up hope everyone's enjoying the content let's get into it let's see here let's listen to this selected going to work for an object of the size and shape I'm building. Two, have I read the schematics thoroughly? And three, do I have all the required materials too? Who the hell bled on my notes? Saul! If I find out you, you're gonna bleed on... Whatever. Just finish work. Short on materials? Loot the local junkyard, mills, and warehouses for parts. Missing a critical schematic? Your local vendors might have just what you're looking for. And on that note, this has been Headmaster Mort's Edutapes, Edutapes. See you again soon. Solomon, so help me this better be dead. Where are you hiding? Welcome back, lovely listeners, to Headmaster Mort's final tape in the camp series. Powering your camp. After listening to the second tape, you should already be well trained, enough to build a generator. If you haven't yet done so, I'll wait. I do, 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 do. I do, 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 do. Ah, screw it. All right, I, I'll assume you nailed it. Now, generators are the heart of your camp power system. Once your generator is built, all you need to do is connect it to the object that needs power with the wire. Though, be aware, your wire will need a clear, unobstructed path to establish and maintain a direct connection. Some objects, however, like simple light bulbs, do not require a direct connection. All you need to do is run a wire from your generator to a power pylon. Place the power pylon near your lights, then voila! Let there be lights! Well, this has been Headmaster Mort's Camp Construction Holotapes. Please check back with Headmaster Mort himself at The Wayward to learn more about his other exciting courses, including... Mort, can I still eat this? And Mutations. Am I a monster now? And thanks again for listening. Ha! Nailed it!
after you completed that quest already. Uh, the one where you gotta listen to the hollow tips. I don't like that it doesn't have a quest menu. So I'm gonna do a little loot in there. In here. I'm gonna go back to my thingy. I think you have to buy stuff. Like, uh, how to build walls and stuff like that. Oh no, I might be wrong about it, but I think that's what's going on. Let me just make this nice and clean for you. I'll just take everything. I need to get lead so I can make bullets. I gotta figure out how to make gunpowder. Oh, hey there. Looking forward to hearing what you thought of those tapes. Now, what'd you want to discuss? Did you now? What did you think? Ha. Huh. Huh. If I needed smoke blowing up my ass, I'd sit on a campfire, okay? Seriously, what'd you think? Yeah, that's what I thought, too. I, I figured I'd do a couple more batches. I mean, I'll have this thing down. Headmaster Mort will be a household name before you know it. Thanks for being honest. Now, was there something else I could do for you? Eh, this stuff in here is probably crap anyways, but I'll grab it real quick and I'll throw it in the uh, camp thing. It's always something good in the bathroom. Most people laugh, going, hey, why are you just grabbing this random shit? It's always something good, usually. Oh, we have to get the toilet paper, man. <laughs> just looking at me like, what the fuck? He stole the toilet paper. <laughs> Come on. It's not fun if you just sit there and, you know... Don't crack some kind of joke or go, hey, I stole the toilet paper out of the bathroom. I feel accomplished. <laughs> Surprised the NPCs just allow me to take all this shit. Not pulling a gun or anything. Probably worthless crap, anyways, but, uh, uh, you know, if it gives you the ability to take it, then I'm taking it. Still gotta figure out the controls for how to crouch and stuff. You think the place looks good now? Wait till we're done rebuilding. Just need those hoodlums to stop breathing down our collective necks. I have to find lead so I can make bullets.
Okay, yeah, have some dog food. Dog food's great. All right, let's just kind of weed out everything that we don't need. Ew, take blood. Ew. Can we eat these? Looks like it. Yeah, let me sell back your seat oil here. That's all aim. That's massive amounts of junk. All right. get something done <laughs> so I'm learning the basics right now it's always the hard part of learning um, we'll have to go in and loot some monuments uh, most Fallout games there's a driven story quest and the more story quests or side quests you do or more locations you get into the quicker you can earn money so I don't know if that's the case here We're about to find out aren't we Search for traces in Flatwoods. I'm just gonna go over here and loot. Let's man. Give me a, give me it all. If we like, stop standing, stop, stop it. Stop it. Ah, oh, that wire is radioactive. Look at it, you got nine rads right there. Yikes. Camp's over here somewhere. It's over here more. There you are. Can I build anything else? Ah, I can. What is this? Weapons workbench. Um, oops. That's not where I wanted that. Perfect, but it works. Lots of options. But it would seem I have to learn how to unlock all this. So much stuff. I don't know what this atomic symbol is. Unlock object in atomic shop. All right. Now I've done enough of dicking around here. Let's go over here. 
to our actual quest that we need to go this way, apparently. Bought more ammo. We do not want to go into the river. Because it's radioactive, apparently. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's going to be an axe in the game at some point where you can chop down trees, but for now, we learn as we go. Looks like the start of a real force in the race. At Victorium. Not sure if I should be thrilled or terrified. Farm right there. Lumber mill for wood. Is this friendly? I don't think this is friendly. I think that's bad. Bomb requires new. Back away, it's gonna blow up. I'm so glad I backed away. Also looking for some treasure? Well, I guess it's your lucky day. I found this map and I ain't got a clue about what it means. Do you want it? Maybe you'll have better luck than I do. Happy digging. <laughs> now I just don't why people are building next to the log. Uh, the logging company landmark. There's just stuff there. Really need to clean up around here. Now the world has gone to shit. The rich gonna be poor, and the poor gonna be rich. Back here. Never know it's evil. What the hell? Battery, all right. Could be good, might be bad.
completed later. I know that's going to be useful at some point. Fallout 4. Gold was a pain to get. I got that kit. Seems like a great place to hang out. Watch, I'm going to have so much junk just hanging around. Just be like, really? Look like things I can get into. Just a bit before the war, there was news of tremors. He, he didn't come home. Red yeah, taste root toothpaste. I don't know what happened to him or why he never came home for sure. And between you and me, I'm fine with that. Since the war, I've just read my old newspapers and listened to music. Very peaceful for once, which is just right nice by me. You ever hear of the Watoga Times Atomic Lottery? The winner got ten years worth of Blamco mac and cheese, and Salisbury steak, and, and Nuka Cola, of course. I played that lottery for twenty years, and I finally won the month before the war. It lasted only eight years, though. <laughs> but who can you complain to? I have to run I back to my camp that, already. I heard the responders' radio broadcast, so I went out to find them and get supplies. Bless their hearts. Well, I'm going home now. For a bit, anyways. <laughs> can I turn this thing off? Oh, blast these things. Not this button, not this one. I may have to move my camp oh. down this way. Oh, here it is. It looks like it might rain later. Ah, hello, person in the distant future. Uh, Dasa told us these tapes would be used as historical records. Yeah, I have a feeling I need to move so my camp down here. Is Miguel Caldera. Uh, let's see, uh, It'll just make it easier to loot the town, let stuff respond, do it again. You know. And, you know, and, and that's okay. <sighs> I used to stare out that window by the coffee machine and think, shucks, I wish I could leave this job and hike in the woods every I dream about walking the Appalachian Trail, setting up camp wherever I liked, and traveling with close friends. 
Definitely should move my camp at some point down here. That's why I'm next to all this junk that spawns in. While you're here, why not grab a stem back or two? Responder training? Then you're not alone. A lot of people come here because of that radio message the responders left. That's what brought me here too. At first I was planning to just do the training and move on, but honestly, I kind of like it here. I really enjoy meeting all the people that pass through and hearing their stories. <laughs> Wait a minute. Are you one of those people who was in Vault 76? I knew it! I could tell just by looking at you. I've always thought that life in a vault must be so amazing. With the robots and all the machines and having everything you need every day. Best of all, you're safe. Which, let me tell you, is a thing us outsiders very rarely get to feel. Though I guess you're one of us now, so that's all in the past for you. Go right ahead. Yeah, there's a couple of places around here that qualify as interesting. At least to me. The Agricultural Research Center is infested with feral ghouls and homicidal robots. But you can find some good scrap in there if you're up to it. The New River Gorge Resort to the east is the same story. 
Maybe, minus the robots. First kind of attack, res registration for a volunteer, huh? No problem. Make yourself at home. I did. I can figure this out. Oh man, it's gonna make me check in. I don't wanna check in. I think I'm gonna go back to camp and drop this crap off. And then come back down here. Hey, look at free stuff. Lock picking system's been over how it's changed. my camp and depot. Okay, I'll come back to this. I think I need to move my camp down here, find a flat spot like right here would work. Wouldn't be great, but it'd work. Uh, the closer I am to the monuments, the more stuff I can get without going too far. As you can tell, my character is having a hell of a time moving at the moment. Too much stuff. And let's grab some more. Why not? Give me that aluminum. I wonder if I can just fast travel to the camp. I'm overcumbered. I have to walk. No. <laughs> I don't. I'm liking it, but I'm also not liking some things. I definitely think I need to generate some caps and move my camp down here, but yeah, it is what it is. I'm not gonna focus on building out much I'm just gonna focus on what I need for so for instance making ammo or making meds and stuff like that eventually get par power armor from a 
my stamina to go back up. Oh crap. Damn hounds are back. I just have a walk around the hounds, but it's a good way to level up too, especially if you're just walk, uh, starting out. Oh man, I gotta deal with this damn thing again. It didn't blow up this time. Yep. Next thing is, I'm gonna have to put stuff into strength. So I just located this area. Does that mean I can fast travel? Yes, it does. It requires one cap though. Some good for once? Make a difference. Word is, the Brotherhood needs new soldiers. So I'm gonna try to do 30 to 45 minute parts, but uh, from what I'm seeing for Fall 76 right now, it's just as bad as Cyberpunk 2077, where you never know how long that mission's going to be. It could be 30 minutes, it could be an hour. So, yeah. I was expecting more from it, though. From my player experience from playing all the Fallouts, eh, it's alright. They definitely need a better way to explain to everyone, hey, this is how you do this, this is how you do that. <laughs> eh, it's whatever. Yeah, I can walk around now. Yay! Need to find the lead. We got a bit of gunpowder now. Lead. I'm gonna go over here and sell off the like hatware and stuff that we just got. Have some dog food. <laughs> so 
healing slave, honeycomb. Uh, we're not going to do 38. Let's get to that. Oh, we're already at 42 minutes. We'll make this video 45 minutes and we'll call it good enough. We have a plan. We're going to run back over to that one spot. Registered, and then we'll move on. Hope everyone's enjoying the gameplay so far. Alright, it's kind of boring. I was hoping for more, like, more story driven. I was hoping. Hoping it would be like Dying Light 2, where your friends can join the game and they can play the campaign with you. Kind of like Halo. Unfortunately, this is nothing on that concept. From what I can tell. Give me. People have come back to this area. They'll all want to be setting up places like Foundation. I don't. Let's play it by ear and see what happens. I should have teleported. Ow! Mill mill of rounds just chilling on the thing there.
Alrighty guys, this looks like a good place to stop. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. I'll see you guys in the next video.